Hi, I'm Kyle, and this is my brother Reed. He's the only crew member here right now, but the rest of us look something like this. We make a variety of animation and live action videos about things like unpopular video games, wearing funny hats, and sometimes about people who hate kittens. Because if we don't represent them, who will? In celebration of reaching the 10,000 subscriber milestone, we will be officially declaring next week 10k week. I am leaving my job as a full-time editor in a month. Hey! We made it to 20,000 subscribers! For our 10-year anniversary of White Lightning, we're, we're getting rid of it. What even is that? It's like, it's like a freaking guy with a hood. We hit 50,000 subscribers. 50,000! That's incredible! Five months. Yeah. And we have doubled the number of people. If you like our work, if you want to see what we can really do, if you've ever wanted to help out, well now's your chance. Oh my god! Hit our goal of $150,000. Thank you all for even caring about this thing in the first place. We've been working with, on this for what feels like 10 years now. Camera speed, sound speed, slide it. We interrupt your regularly scheduled programming to bring you uh, two months of silence and now uh, this. We've needed some breaks and there's been a lot of ups and downs and all kinds of stuff. I've been having a few problems with depression, so I've been taking some time to figure out uh, what's causing it and what changes I need to make. Boy, do I have news <laughs> for you! <laughs> I've... gotten to do everything I wanted to do. Even in my day-to-day -day life, I, I'm not sure I would have stayed friends with everybody that's on the channel right now. They were my high school friends. Nobody stays friends with their high school friends. But I got to because I, I came up with this way to make them keep coming back and, and do stuff with me all the time. 2019 has been a bit slow. Uh, for the channel. If you've been watching the videos, uh, again, I've, I've, it's all stuff that I've said before. I really just hoped the whole time that one day I would I would just wake up and uh, something would click and I'd know, like, this is the big plan, this is what I want to do. And so that's why you've also seen updates about, like, okay, we're doing this new thing, you know, we're doing Black Pants Film School, we're doing more sketches now, Ricky's making sketches. That's just not how that works in, in real life. You know, you don't just have a single moment of clarity that fixes everything. When I started the channel, I was inspired by YouTube channels from 2010, and I wanted to make a great 2010 YouTube channel, and I can satisfyingly say now that I, I did that. I did all of it. I did every single thing I wanted to do to make a great 2010 YouTube channel in 2015 and onwards. But now, um, it's done. I, I, I did it, and it's 2020, and YouTube is different and I have other things that I want to do. It's time for the Door Monster production company to move on to uh, bigger and multiple things, and the channel will be one of, hopefully, eventually many products. And the channel in its current form has taken pretty much all of my time and energy to make stay afloat at all because of the way that YouTube works. So I've known that the sketches needed to end for a while. In addition to having gotten everything that I personally need from them, they're not treated well by YouTube. They never really have been. Uh, YouTube's been pretty down on short form sketch comedy since I started doing it regularly. I've been trying to figure out uh, something else that I would be able to be as excited about starting as I was about the sketches when I first started those, and that utilized all of the resources and the people that we now have available. Uh, and the thing that I've settled on is a D&D and tabletop gaming themed channel. We love tabletop gaming and Dungeons and & Dragons and Pathfinder and all of that stuff here at Door Monster. It's one of our favorite pastimes. We do it all the time. We all have our own games that we run and we cycle in and out working on them. The D&D sketches are far and away our most popular videos as it is. And we have fun making them too because it can be a whole production. There's costumes and visual effects and all kinds of stuff that I've been able to do with them that I've really enjoyed. It's a whole wealth of stories and characters and writing and pretty much everything that I like about the filmmaking process but uh, instantaneous and kind of improv and uh, done in a group with all of the people that I love working with. So in trying to decide what it is we wanted to focus on, something that we could actually do with the channel that would be successful and that 
everybody could be a part of and all the crew could actually get in on and invest in and, you know, that wouldn't rely on me doing all of the work, D&D seemed like a very logical option. Our basic plan is to have a lot of different shows ranging from gameplay to uh, other content surrounding the art and the creation aspects of Dungeons & Dragons, while also still having occasional sketches that are themed around the same topic. If you've been here for the sketches only and you're disappointed to hear this news, I 100% understand, and I just want to say thank you so much for supporting me and my friends and letting us do this crazy thing that we've done for the past few years. The thing I'm afraid of is becoming one of those channels that people go, oh yeah, I remember when they were good, I wish that was still happening, because despite losing the passion for what it was they were doing, they just keep doing the same thing over and over and over again. And I don't want people comparing the things we do now to the things that we used to do either. Um, which is why it just made the most sense to make a clean break, pick something new, and start on that instead. The reason that you've enjoyed watching all of the videos that I've made is because of how much I enjoyed making them. I have always been so excited about everything that we've done on the channel. I've been so happy to be working on it. I've been so into every single thing. I wake up wanting to make it. And it showed, it made a difference. It, that That's what made those videos so great. And the reason I've been having trouble this year is because that feeling kind of disappeared. And when I don't have that, I just don't know what to do. But now, working on this new idea with my friends, coming up with this new... Uh, line up and and preparing this this whole new journey and project I'm freaking excited again and it's been a while uh, and I I've I love feeling this way again and I can't wait to work on this stuff and to show it to all of you and you've seen the result of that in the past so at the very least I can promise this will be something to watch I care a lot about what you guys think and I want to talk to you I am going to be monitoring the comments of this video all day long because uh, I there's no way I can't. I did want to go ahead and just address a few things that might be asked in the comments a lot first before I close this out. First, we are not changing our name again. Uh, there's been some confusion about that even among the crew, but Door Monster, the name is staying. It's the name of the company. And it's also weirdly relevant to a D&D channel because of like mimics and it also shortens to DM, so that's convenient. The content will be centered around tabletop RPGs and that kind of subject matter, not just Dungeons and Dragons. As for what I will be doing personally, I'm going to be managing a a lot of big secret projects behind the scenes, as well as working on the not-so-secret sequel to the guards themselves, which is turning out amazing. Not having to write sketches and manage the channel fully every single week is going to go a long way towards making sure I can put all my effort into that movie, which is good, uh, because you donated money toward it, and I want to make it as good as physically possible. This is a really big change. I know it is, and uh, I know it can be disappointing to see eras end. Um, I hold on to things, honestly, longer than I should. This probably is a change that should have come a little bit earlier than now, um, but I also think I needed this year to just kind of figure some things out, uh, and I really look forward to trying something completely new. To all of you who decide to stick with us and see where this goes, thank you in advance. Um, you're probably the same people who have been here since I was animating things before 2010, so thank you for that too, and uh, I hope you enjoy the ride. Happy New Year. It shouldn't have worked, but it did. That's our new slogan, White Lightning HQ, it shouldn't work, but it does. <laughs> Kyle's also pursuing professional filmmaking. <laughs> Am I? It's your job now.